Evening everybody, Rich here, back for part 8 of this RMS Titanic tutorial. Today's focus will be the stern deck uh, details like cranes, bollards, uh, the docking bridge and all things like that. So that will be on the uh, poop deck and the well, the deck forward of that. I don't know what that deck is called, but uh, I think it's the, the aft well deck, but I can't uh, be sure on that. But before we go ahead and do that, I'm just going to go down to add the bridge wings to the ship. So we're on the uh, front of the boat deck. Got the bridge wheelhouse just there, and on the side with the uh, wall at the side here. And what we do on the outside, we add uh, a row of three blocks there, and then another row of three blocks, like so. And then we add another two blocks there, like so, just to build basically just going out the side one by one block. So you just add three, then two in, and then we add a corner block, corner block, corner block, and corner block. And however you want to do this, whether you use slabs or um. Uh, blocks is up to you, but I'm going to use uh, quartz blocks just to add the roof like so. And there's your bridge wing. And if you want to, on top we add a color block to, for the light, and it should look something like that. So you can go in here and not see very much, but uh, the bridge wing is on there anyway. So that is that little job done on the left. So I should do the same on the right. So just fly down to the right hand side. So on the outside edge, add three blocks there, and then three blocks on top. And then on the back, two blocks in like that. So you've got a shape like that. And then a block, block, and a block, and a block. And then nine along the top. Like so. And then another colour block for another light. Not sure what the colour what colour the lights are meant to be, but I just put yellow blocks to mark them. You probably could use um, redstone torches or whatever. Uh, if they're still available. Not sure. But uh, that's the cargo hat. No, not the cargo hat. That's the... That's the, that's the um, the bridge wings done so that's that little job done uh, before I move on as well I just want to point out I have added doors and windows to all the uh, boat deck superstructure um, it's my usual design say six windows a door six windows doors and there's no real um, pattern well I say, I say there is a pattern but it's a very vague one so it's not accurate to the real ship so if you've got proper deck plans then you might want to do this properly but I'm just showing you that I've added doors and windows to all the uh, the deck houses on the boat on the boat deck, and the same with the third funnel region, the middle deck house, and lastly the fourth funnel and the last deck house. I think this is where the elevators. I think this is the elevator shaft, and that's what that one's for. So that's all those bits done there. Right, that's all that. So what we're going to do now is head over to the what's called the poop deck or the stern deck, depends what you want to call it. And we're going to go right to the very end. And we're going to add the docking bridge. So we're going to go right to the end. Uh, the centre block of the back, which is this point here. So that's the centre block. And on the wood, we're going to count forward 17 blocks. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Like so. so I'll put a, a block in the market. So that's 17. And then out to the side, we want to build 4. Uh, so count out, count out 4, not build 4. So we want to count out one two three four and on the fifth block we build up three so one two three same the other side we count four one two three four and on the fifth block one two three like so so that's the pillars for the docking bridge and I'm going to use a uh, light gray wool for the flooring of the uh, docking bridge so along the top we add another block there and another block there like so and then we add, well, join them together, may, may as well. Join them together across like so. And it should look something like that. And then in the centre of that white line, we're going to add a white block there. And we're going to build the back wall of the docking bridge. Now I'm just trying to work out how long this is. So it's th it should be 37 wide, uh, the full length. So what's that? That's, that's uh, is it 18 either side. I shall count it and find out. So I build out 18 anyway. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So there's 18 there. Do the 18 the other side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Piss. So I'm going to measure that and count it again. Right, bear with me. So count from there to there. So that was 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So it's 18 either side, so that should be 37. I'll just make sure. Math's not my top subject. And yep, that's 37. So that's 37 wide, like that. And then what we want to do for the sides, you're going to build three forwards. So go one, two, three. And then back inwards, you're going to build 
14. So you have 14 in which so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And then 2 forward, 1, 2, like that. So it's outwards, inwards 3, four, uh, uh, forward 3, inwards 14, and then forward 2. So I did the same on the other side. So we go 1, 2, 3. And then 14 in. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And then 1, 2 forward. And then we just join them across the front like that. So that is the rough outline of the docking bridge. And maybe if you want to, you can bring it further forward because it's probably not accurate to the real thing. But I think uh, where I've put it, it's not too bad. But it may be more further forward. It's up to you what you want to do. Um, and then for the flooring of the uh, docking bridge, we just use the grey wool and uh, fill that all in and it shouldn't be too bad when it's all done so I'll just do this as quick as I can and there we go that's the docking bridge laid out and it should look something like that and then back to the back wall of the uh, docking bridge I'm going to remove that center block we don't need that anymore Got to mark out from the center, so maybe I should have used that, but that's the center block. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six to the right. This is only on the right, and we're going to mark out our stairs. So from there, we put a stair block, then a white block, stair block, white block, stair block, white block, and then another stair block. And that is the stairs for the docking bridge. And then for the banisters, we just go two up, two up, two up. Same the other side, two up, two up, two up, like that. So that's the stairs done. And that's only on the right hand side, okay? So you don't need to add one to the left. So that's that. And then lastly, um, I'm going to get some handrails. We're going to use iron bars for this. And we're just all the way around, we just add the handrails all the way around. So you just get all the way down the back, around the side, and up along the front. And then down the other side. <coughs> and there we go. That's the docking bridge pretty much done. There is a little bit of detail to go on the front of the docking bridge. I'm not sure what it is. Whether it's the mechanisms to control the stern, I'm not sure. But uh, offset from the centre. So from the centre of the uh, wider part. So for roughly this point. I'm going to go one to the left. And go one, two, three up. And then one to the right. One, two, three up. I don't know what these things are. But I've got a model and that's pretty much what it is, it's just two little masks like that, but it's probably more for the mechanics, uh, mechanisms to, to control the ship, I'm not entirely sure, so um, I'm going to leave it, it leave it like that, so that's our little job, so that's the uh, docking bridge added, and now what we want to do now is add seats, so I'm going to go back down to the back of the, of the poop deck, so here, and bear with me while I check my notes, so bear with me on that, right, so what we're going to do from this uh, centre block, we're going to go from the uh, wood block again and we're going to leave an eight block gap so count nine forward so one two three four five six seven eight nine and put a center white block and this will be the center of the seats and the seats themselves are going to be three wide so we're going to use uh, quartz for the middle and then stairs for the edges for the uh, benches so it's three wide like that and then the, le the length is going to be eight long so two three four five six seven eight and then we just add the sides like so that's one side and then the other and <gasps> probably there we go so they're probably a bit wider than what you would what we would like but there's no big deal I mean it's only representing benches but that's the first set so that's eight long and then what you're going to do is go forward of that point so <laughs> right so <laughs> From the forward edge of the seats we just built, we're going to leave a, a six block gap. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And on the seventh block, we build the next set. So middle block and then the stairs. So remember, this is on the center line of the stern. So remembering that. And so it's three wide like that. And then the length is 26 long. So that's one long already. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. That's 26 long. 
like so. And then we just add the side benches for them. All the way down the length of the stern deck. And then same the other side. Preferably not doubling them up. And there we go. So that's 26 long there. And then roughly halfway down the length of it. So I'm not going to say an exact number. But roughly halfway down the length. Say roughly this part. I'm not going to, like I say, I'm not going to give a, a full, an exact dimension. But say roughly halfway down. You're going to count out eight from the middle. So or eight from this side block. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we'll start adding our next set of benches. So that's the middle block there. And I'll do the same on the other side. And that is a, I think it's a seven gap. Yep, so it's a seven gap, so same the other side. Six, seven, and then we add the eighth block there. So you've got a block there and a block there. Like I said, it's roughly the middle. It's, it's roughly along the middle of that 26. This doesn't have to be exact. But that's there. And then forward of this point, you're going to build these benches uh, ten long. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Same the other side, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that's those two in place. And then we just add the benches to the sides. Like so, that's one side and then the other side here. And there we go, that's the uh, benches all in place. And it kind of looks like an unhappy face, depending which way you look at it. Right, so that's those bits done. And now what we're going to do is add three sets of bollards. Now, like on the, uh, the folk saw, they're going to be sat on top of a grey block. A uh, grey wool block, if I can find it. There it is. So a grey wool block plus anvils. So we need anvils as well. So I'm not going to put these in an exact position either, but roughly spread evenly apart. So I'll put the first set of anvils roughly along the well, roughly near the forward edge of the uh, of the um, poop deck so I'll say not forward not close to the forward edge but say about a 10 gap and then we add the bollards to the top like that so that's one set and then roughly just in front of the uh, docking bridge we add another set and then two bollards there and then in the corner or the curve of the uh, stern itself we'll add another set so two facing the other way so two facing like that so that's the three bollard sets like that so I'll do the same the other side and try and do this as best I can without screwing it up so um, screw it up already so about there I think wouldn't it yep let me just add the bollards and then the next set along we go roughly here and then the bollards, and then the next set along. There we go there. Is that right? Yeah. So as long as I line them up both sides, they should be fine. And there we go. There's the three sets of bollards. And that's that little jobby done there. And then you want a couple of um, cap stands as well. I don't know if they're actually called that on the stern because uh, details are a bit vague. But I'm just trying to remember where they go as well. I just see they go, seeing from here, roughly behind the side. Um, the side benches so back edge of the benches on the side here we would go one block out and just add some four squares like that and then we use sounds silly but brown carpet on the top for the bronze effect preferably using the proper thing not bloody flowers so add one there and then the same the other side and there we go so we got two cap stands other side of the benches and uh, that should be that little job there so that is almost all the details for the stern done uh, what we're going to do first is go down to the center block of the uh, back of, of, of the front wall of the poop deck and find the center block which I'm going to mark out in grey which will go there so that's the center block and we're going to mark out where the cranes go so I'm just going to change the page of my notes to work out what to do and from the centre block here, we're going to count forward six blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So six forward, which goes over the second block of the middle bench. So it's six forward, and then we want the eleventh block out. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And on that eleventh block, we put a yellow block there. 
So I do the same the other side, so it's six forward, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then eleven out, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And that's another block there. Those two are mark where the cranes go. So I'm going to work on the left hand side first. So this block here we add a block forward and a block back. And then along the front we add three across. Same way along the back we add three across there. And then across the other side like that. So you've got the shape like that. So it's a square but you've got three blocks like that. So you've got a, three, you've got a nine block gap in the middle. So it's basically the same design as I used on, on the um, well deck. So it's one yellow and then you want uh, two in white. So just double it in height or make it three blocks high so you've got one yellow at the bottom and then two in white like so and then we add the top like so and depending which way you want the cranes facing on the, on the prototype I've got the cranes facing towards the center but you can have them facing forwards outwards backwards or whichever way you want but I'm gonna have mine facing inwards so in the middle here we go up uh, five, so one, two, three, four, five, and then to the front of it, one, two, three, four, five, and then to the other side, one, two, three, four, five, where the uh, body of the crane is facing for, uh, facing the middle, sorry, and then we add the counterweight at the top, like so. So that's the crane body, and then for the uh, crane arm, which I'm going to use uh, stone slabs again, we're going to use from the uh, second block up, sorry, on the on the body, you're going to build the crane arm. Uh, 11 long so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 same the other side 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and then we add 1 2 there like that so for the center so that is the first crane done so shall I do the same the other side so that's that block there so one forward and one back and then two out there and then two out there and then two down the side so you roughly got a three block gap out to the side of the ship from the crane itself. And then what we do is just increase the height of the sides. So like I say it's one yellow, two white at the top. And we had the body, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Counterweight on the back. And then the arm. One block up from the top, so we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and then the 2, like that. So that's the two cranes added, and I think that is pretty much all the stern details that I have written down. And it should look something like that, so it's not too bad, It's got we've got the details on there. And then the last job for the poop deck today is to add the handrails, so I'm going to use iron bars again and then we go from the stairs we just add the handrails around the edge So it does take a little while but when it's done it all looks nice and neat and detailed and I've screwed it up already <laughs> and then across the front And there we go, that's the uh, poop deck, or stern deck, pretty much done. There may be more details to come on later on, but I'm not going to uh, go into it now. So, um, we'll leave it at that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a quick jump cut and uh, measure out the next details, and then I shall return and start with that. So, uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. Now I'm going to move on to the next section of the stern, which is the area between the poop deck and the... Uh, main superstructure we're on this area here We've got stairs going down there and stairs going down there to meet this section here right so what we're going to do is go to the front wall of the uh, poop deck first and before we build the cargo hatches we're going to go under the tunnels here so inside the tunnels in this area here we're going to add 
uh, some doors and things but first because I haven't capped these areas off here gotta cap the uh, tops off so I just fill that in as quick as I can because it's something I forgot like I, like I did on the uh, on the forecastle so I did the same the other side it's one of those silly jobs that I did and there we go that's those areas capped off and on the inside here we can add some doors and windows so I'm gonna find the door and we're going to need a glass block as well, which is always handy. And so roughly in the centre, add a couple of doors. And then around the edges, we add a window and a window. And then a window there and a window there, like so. And I do the same the other side. So like I say, roughly centre, add a stair, uh, the door, sorry, a door there, a door there. Window, window window and a window so it's not strictly accurate to the real thing but as it's covered up I don't think many people get to see it anyway so that's that um, so what I'm going to do now is just get those tools back that I had so I want the iron bars back and we're going to want the quartz slab back as well so I'll get the quartz slab and put that back right so now what we're going to do now is go back to this front wall of the poop deck stern deck and the center block here and what we're going to do is build the first cargo hatch um, it's going to be five blocks long, so we're going to leave from this back wall. We're going to leave a five block gap. So one, two, three, four, five forward, and we're going to build the front of the cargo hatch there because the back wall of the cargo hatch is actually this wall here. So it's five gap, and then the width is thirteen. So that's that six other side. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and we build the sides up to the wall there. And the other side, like so. And I should have done that in yellow. I apologise there. That should have been, should have been yellow. So apologies there. It's been a long day, but yeah, the cargo hatch should be in yellow. And then, like so, so that's the shape of it. And uh, just make sure it is long. Yeah, five long. Yeah, it's five long, and then double it in height for the yellow. So make it two blocks high in yellow. So just trying to read my notes at the same time here, so make it two blocks high in yellow, like so, and then we add the cargo roof hatch, or the cargo hatch roof, sorry. So on the centre block, the centre seven sections of the cargo hatch are going to be one block high, so in the middle, and then three out the side, three out the side like that, and then all the way back to the back wall of the cargo hatch. Like so, and then for the sides, you want to make it one block high, or one slab high. Sorry, so it's not one block; it's one slab, like that. And we do the same the other side. There we go. So it's similar to the ones on the forecastle, but uh, slightly wider. Because the ones on the front, on the uh, well deck, sorry, not the forecastle, on the well deck, they are eleven wide, whereas these ones are thirteen. So that's the first hatch, and then we're going to do is leave a nine block gap so the center block of this uh, cargo hatch we're going to count uh, eight uh, no hang on a nine block gap f forward so one two three four five six seven eight nine and on the tenth block we build the next hatch in yellow so there we go so it's a, it's a nine block gap so I just measure that to make sure so from there to there it's nine blocks that's fine and the same hatch again it's going to be uh, eleven wide and the side should be six so no it's 13 wide so one two three four five six that way one two three four five six that way so it's 13 wide and then the sides should be six so one two three four five six there we go same the other side one two three four five six so you get the uh, cargo hatch in that area there and then double that in height all the way around there, and then the center seven sections again are one block high so one and then one two three and one two th two three and then just build that all the way forward like so and then we just add the half block slab for the rest of it And the same on the other side. And 
and there we go that's the two cargo hatches done and uh, should look something like that now what you want to do is add a couple of sets of bollards so we're going to work on the right hand side and I'm not going to put these in any specific place but roughly a few, about two or three blocks back from the stairs uh, the, the forward stairs we're going to add two blocks and then two bollards and then roughly in front of the uh, the back the, the front wall of the folks or of the uh, poop deck sorry we had two facing that way and then a couple of bollards there as well so you got a bollard set there and a bollard set there and I'll do the same the other side roughly here I think it was so one two there and one two and then the same on the other side just got to measure it out properly roughly about there and there we go so that's the two sets there so it's set in front of the stairs but set by the side of the stairs and I think they are roughly the right place so yep they're fine uh, they're not uh, in the real positions but they're as, as good as so that's the uh, the bollards done now bear with me while I work out how to do the cranes because there's going to be two cranes on this bottom deck here and there's going to be two cranes on the promenade up there so just work out how this is done uh, we're going to work on the left hand side just so everyone knows <clears throat> so on the left hand side of the ship I'm going to go down to the, the stairs down here which go down to the uh, bottom deck here and you've got this inside banister here so you've got the outside there which is closest to the outside of the ship you've got this inside banister here and you're going to count one block forward of that banister, so one forward, uh, or, or one gap really, so onto the second block, and put a yellow block, and that's where we're going to start building our uh, crane. So it's one block there, and then two forward of that, and then three across there, and then three back there, and then three across there. So that's where our crane goes. So it's one yellow at the bottom, and then two white on top. Like so and then we add the roof to it and that's the crane body done so you got a bit of uh, squeezing to do to try and get through the gap but when you come down the stairs you can get between the bollards and the crane but the crane body is there and the crane here is facing back facing towards the poop deck and the crane body itself is six high so one two three four five six up one two three four five five six one two three four five six and then the counterweight on the back and then the crane arm itself using slabs stone slabs is going to be 12 so second block up we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten <gasps> eleven twelve same the other side one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and then two at the end like that so that's that crane done there and it don't look too bad so I did the same the other side so like before, got the stairs banisters here, inside ones, one block gap, second block, put a block, and then build two forward, two across the back, or two across the other side, and then two, or three, sorry, so it's two down, three across, three, three, so it's shaped like that, so it's three, 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 three. And then we increase the height to two blocks high on the white, so it's one yellow, two white, and then we add the roof. And then once again the crane faces the poop deck, so we build it fire six high. One, two, three, four, five, six. I did build the other one six high, didn't I? I'll just double check that because I can't remember. And yeah, that's six high. So that's six high for the body. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then the counterweight. And then the, the crane arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <gasps> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and then 2 at the end, like that. So that's the two cranes done there, and that's that little deck area done. So that's all we have to do there. Right, so now we move up to the promenade deck. So the boat deck is the top deck, and then the next deck down is the promenade deck. So I'm going to work in this corner area here. So I'm working on the uh, right-hand side. And what you want to do, the measurements for this is a bit vague, so... What you want to do is you've got the back wall here, which is cl well, the closest to the, the side, so it's back wall here, and you're going to leave a one block gap, and then put a block there, and on the side you're going to leave a one block gap, and put a block there as well, so you've got a one block gap from the back, and one block gap from the side, 
and that's what we're going to build our crane so from these two blocks we build two that way and then two there so that's the diameter of the crane body and then we build the three across there and the three across there so there we go so you've got a one block gap along the back there and a one block gap along the side so that should give you the rough diameter uh, rough dimensions of where the crane should go and then we do the same again we make make it yellow one high and then white two high And then we make it, uh, or build the roof, sorry, roof of the crane body. And then like the crane below, we build this one facing the poop deck. So on the centre we build up six again. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And three across for the counterweight. And then for the crane arm, it's 12 again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, plus the 2, and there we go. That's the crane added there. And that's our little job done. Right, so we'll do the same on the other side. So once again, one block from the outside edge, and one block from the front, or the back, sorry. And the crane should go there, so... So it's 3 back, 3 side, and 3 at the back there, and 3 there, so there we go roughly the same position so one gap front or back and one gap side and then we add two rows of white along the top and then the roof and then for the body again facing the folk uh, the, the stern we go one two three four five six one two three three four five six one two three two three four five six and then the counterweight and then the arm again one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and then the two at the end and there's those two cranes done there and that's that little job done right so I think we can cap it off more or less there but one more job to do with uh, small details and we're going to go to the deck between the promenade deck and the bottom well deck. So we've got this, uh, it's the same deck with the two windows. We've got the two windows there. So we go to the deck along the side here. And roughly halfway along the side wall of the two window building, roughly halfway along, say, roughly about here, and we're going to go one, two, three out. Actually, I'm going to measure this on the uh, prototype actually because I don't want to get this wrong. So we're going to be building this uh, vent here. So how far back was it? It was. Uh, it was 12 back, so 12 back from the uh, front of the, or the back wall of the two window building. So we'll work on the right hand side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, like so. And then 1, 2, 3 out on the deck below. We build the 3 bottom base, and then the 1, 2 up like that. Or is it 3 up, and then the 2 at the back. Uh, no, it's two, and it's just three up, three base. So it's, a, it's a T like that, with two at the back, and then a quartz stair, which I can never find. Um, yeah, it's got quartz stair to go on the back like so, and then a block on the front. So that's the that's the um, the the, uh, the the vent. Once again, two bollocks and a schlong, and it should be <laughs> shaped like that. Um, yeah, so it's a two gap, so we'll do the same the other side, so 12 back, wouldn't it? But I'm not going to measure, I'm just going to go roughly along this line here. And then a two gap, so one, two, three, and then one, two up, so it's a T, and then two at the back, and then the stairs on the top, and then a block forward. And there we go, that's the other vent done. So you've got two vents now, either side of the two windows building. And that's our little job done there. So one more job building before we uh, top it off. And we're going to go to the back wall of the uh, two windows. You've got the two big windows here. Sensor block along the top, which is here. And we're going to add where the mast goes. Now we're going to leave an eight block gap. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And on the ninth block, we start where the mast goes. Now I'm not going to build the mast. I'm just going to place the first few blocks 
so we know where the mast goes. So the mast, like I said with the foc'sle, can either be three wide or one wide, depends what you want to do. But that's where the mast will go. And uh, that's that thing done there. So that's the mast, where it will go, and we'll put that in later on when we do the funnels and all the other things as well. So that's that. And then for the next job I want to do is just to add handrails. Uh, so we've done around the around the, the uh, stern deck, so I'm just going to do these two decks here. So we add some handrails alongside the stairs there, and then up to the middle building around the diagonal bit there. So there we go, that bit done. And the same the other side. Add the handrails down here. And there we go, that's the uh, that deck done there. And the same for the... Uh, promenade deck so I'll go from the front of the crane and we add the handrail so you can see the uh, the deck or the side walls of the the superstructure is all white and then from there we go uh, or it's one block higher and then from there where it drops we go handrails so let's build the handrails around the sides of the uh, two window building And there we go, that's those two decks done. So there will be more handrails to go on the boat deck, but we'll worry about that another day. But so uh, that's the main jobbies for today. Uh, may as well do one more little jobby, which is to curve off the uh, the uh, white section. So from the poop deck, uh, along the yellow line here, we build up one, two, three, one, two, one, to, to curve it off. Or if you want to, you make it just sort of shaped like that, but I'll make it how I made it. So it's three up, two up, one. Same on the other side, we go three up, one, two, three, two, one. And that's those two sides curved off. And same the other side. So we do one, two, three, one, two, one. And then finally the front end, one, two, three, one, two, one. And there we go. That's that all sorted off. Sorted out. Sorted off. Right, so there we go. That's the uh, poop deck, the middle deck, and the uh, cranes on the upper decks there. And. That's pretty much all I'm willing to do for today. So that's that. We've done the forecastle yesterday. Well, the uh, stern area is done today, and uh, yeah, we're not done too bad, have we? So that's pretty much it for part uh, eight, and so this is part eight. So for part nine, I'm not really sure what to do, but I think uh, we may as well get on and do the funnels, at least for for part nine. So yeah, for part nine, we'll do the funnels, uh, maybe the mast as well, and I think we can probably cap this off in ten parts. So, uh, we're getting a lot done, and uh, I will do a video eventually of the, um, the majesty, majestic over there, but that'll be another day. Um, but yeah, this, like I said, there's still plenty more to do, but yep, yep, next part, part 8 will be, no, part 9, sorry, will be the funnels and the masts, and then part 10 we'll get onto the smaller details, probably the lifeboats, and then all the vents and things as well. So still plenty more to do, but we're definitely cracking on and getting on with it. But like I say, we'll probably cap this all off in 10 parts and uh, the job will all be done. So yeah, like I say, part 9 will be funnels and all that. I keep saying that, so sorry. But anyway, this is Rich signing off, logging off and disappearing. And hopefully I shall return in part 9, so uh, bye for now.